Welcome to another 10 minute test where we rank games based on the first 10 minutes of gameplay. Is that enough time to leave us wanting more? Let's find out right now. How's it going everybody? Samuel here from The Game Dudes coming at you with another 10 minute test. Today's game is Muck. What is Muck? I have no idea. <clears throat> well, I have a little bit of an idea as I found it on YouTube. Uh, the creator of this game, Danny, is a uh, single man kind of uh, video game production guy. Uh, he does it all himself. He's got another game called Carlson that I like, but I also just discovered this a couple days ago. Um, from what I could find on YouTube in the video that I watched, it's basically a survival type game. Um, don't exactly know what to expect. Uh, looks like a little bit of chaos. Uh, don't know the actual purpose of the game. Anyway, let's jump right into this. We're just going to host a lobby because I'm not really sure what this all entails. Player damage off. Difficulty normal. We'll play normal. We'll assume that normal is what the developer wants the game to be played as. Uh, game mode versus creative and survival. <clears throat> cool that there's a versus mode. Uh, and you can enter custom seats. Well, that's very cool. So I think this game um, has a bit of a speed running community too. I think that's the video that I saw. Anyway, we're going to just jump right into Muck. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, day zero. Okay, I'm assuming we can open this. E, F, F, click. Uh, doesn't seem to allow me to open the chest. E space, shift, control, E, F. Okay, we've got a blue marker here. Is this a tutorial? Find and pick up a rock. Okay, yes, we're finding and picking up a rock. <clears throat> so we have located the mysterious rock. Oh, there's definitely sprinting uh, stamina. Okay, we've picked up the rock. Tab to open inventory. Put the rock into my hand. What is that? Slap a tree. <laughs> okay. Let's go slap this tree. Slappy time. Slappy time. Slappy time. So a little bit of, uh, you know, the standard Minecraft type um, game mechanics here where it's like going to be like a crafting survival. Open inventory and craft a workbench. Okay. Right here's a workbench. Uh, what do I do? Do I drag this in there? No. Right click it. No. Wood ten. I need. I need more wood. Do I have to finish chopping the tree to get the wood? I picked up some flax seed. Gets. It's, it's nice to have a well balanced diet. You know, keep yourself regular out here surviving. Okay, we have a crafting table. I'm gonna assume I put it in my hands and set it down somewhere. Oh, or I could swing it. Unlocked bark, unlocked chest, unlocked wood doorway, unlocked wood doorway, unlocked wood floor. Okay, so we've got, we're unlocking a whole bunch of stuff. Wooden pole, wooden poles. Um, I think that's it for the tutorial. Now it's just like, go ahead, bro, have a have a heck of a time. Bark, not sure what bark is for. Chest, obviously for storing things. I just made a bunch of bowls, and I don't know why okay let's see what else see can we get rock from rock no we can't but we can get tree more trees it's always good to have trees huh so bark maybe is is used for creating well obviously it's used for creating more stuff 25 gold open chest huh well, what is this here? Coal. Okay, it doesn't seem like we can get coal with rock either. I'm coming into this completely blind. Okay, we've got some bark. Oh, here's tools. Oh, okay, we need bark and wood. Five wood, five bark. All right. Like I said, I'm coming into this completely blind, like I do all games that we review here. So... If you're familiar with Muck watching this, I apologize. I probably look pretty uh, newbie right now. Oh, look, a statue. I wonder who the statue's for. Challenge Guardian. 
I probably want a weapon before I challenge a guardian. <laughs> okay, let's see. We've got an axe. Okay, I bet the axe will now allow me to chop down this tree here that I wasn't able to chop down a second ago. You would think, but no. Maybe faster tree chopping? It is a bit faster. Tis a bit faster. But not fast enough. I need a chainsaw. All right. Graphically speaking, it weirdly reminds me of like an HD version of that South Park game that came out for N64. I don't know why. Just everything kind of looks like construction paper a little bit. And I don't hate it. I mean, obviously, that, that sunset looks pretty awesome. Good job, Danny. Good job, Danny. Oh, I need more bark. Okay. Let's get some bark. Tools. Okay, we got a pickaxe. There's a furnace and a cauldron. And we can build a little uh, shack here, too, if we want to. So that's nice. Oh, and there's bad guys around now. I'm assuming he's a bad guy. He's got a yellow bar above his head. And he's throwing stuff at me. <laughs> Dude. Okay, I hope that the axe is a is a is a suitable weapon. Okay, it seems like it is. We'll just slap this kid around. Hey! What did he drop? A coin? Are they bad too? Oh, there's all kinds of baddies around here. Alright, so at nighttime, the baddies come out to play. I love the character design, actually. You know what? It's quite nice. Everything's kind of fun. Could do with some more sound effects, but, you know, what are you going to do? Maybe I can make up my own sound effects for the next guy who tries to attack me. Hey! Is that is that my sound effects for that guy? He, go, he comes out of the ground and goes, hey! Okay, I actually think I'm hurting quite a bit. I need maybe to go kill a... Uh, Let's go kill a cow. Day one, okay. Oh, we have the uh, the gold coins, and those I think, I think I read on the chest that that's how you open coins. Let's just see if we can kill a cow. Get over here, cowboy. You're donezo. Hey, we got meat. Collected raw meat. Now, I guarantee eating raw meat is not the way you want to go. So let's look at our workbench and see. Cauldron in a furnace. Probably a furnace, huh? 15 rocks? Let's go grab some more rocks. Hey, we got some coal. That's nice. You know, I have to say that the simplicity of the game is... Oh, I bet I can eat mushrooms. I don't know which mushrooms are probably good to eat, though. Uh, there's only one way to find out, in my experience, when it comes to mushroom hunting. Yummy. That one says yummy, yummy. They all say yummy. Okay, let's eat some shrooms and see what happens. You're going yellow first. Okay, just straight up food. Okay, this one seems to be not helping my hunger. Red. Oh, the red healed me instantly. That's nice. Okay, so red and yellow are good. It seems. And the rest are kind of whatever. It seemed like it was taking away from my food a little bit, perhaps. Oh, man. I am feeling the, uh, the hunger right now. I need to start cooking some food. And the unfortunate thing about the 10-minute test is that just like that... It's over. Let's challenge this guardian. Let's challenge this guardian before we uh, 
call it a day here. Oh, that's a big boy. Oh, I think I can take him now. Oh, no, I can't take him. I can't take him. Oh, my God. All right, so that's going to do it for the 10 minute test. Um, love the graphics, love the gameplay that guardian was it yeah buff guardian holy smokes i really thought i could take him i couldn't what a challenge this this seems to be i think i'm gonna have to like make armor and weapons and oh man all right well i mean we have a rating scale here at 10 minute test zero through five zero being i'm never touching this game again as long as i live i want nothing to do with it to five being as soon as I stop this video, I'm going to keep playing. I, without a doubt, am going to keep playing this game. Five out of five. I love this game. It seems awesome. I love that there's a speedrunning community. I'm going to check that out. Five out of five, guys. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe on this video. We'll see you on the next one. Can you feel